middle seat in your living. Oh, I mean. Mr. Gardens Trail, then the destination is on your left. Botanical Garden. Vista Gardens is a residential community. Yeah. In 500 feet. Good morning, everybody. It is a Tuesday, March 20th, and right, or it's Tuesday, right? Mm -hmm. Don't know the days of the week when you're on vacation. Um, and we are at McKee Botanical Garden. I'm very excited. We've never been here before. We've never been in Vero before, so that makes sense. Um, it's about $12 admission per adult, so um, we are going to head in. We just parked, and I'm going to take you guys around with us. And we're hoping to have lunch here. They have a little garden cafe, so we're gonna probably spend the morning here, um, grab some lunch, and then we'll head back to the resort. And I'll talk to you later. Looks like the cafe is over here in the restrooms. We have the garden gift and bookshop. Oh, you can recycle our receipt too, hon. No, I'm gonna keep it just. Oh, okay. Oh, look, they've got different exhibits. The exhibit right here now, or here right now, is the It's a Jungle Out There exhibit. It's from. Um, from November 4th of last year through April 29th of this year. It features sculptures made out of recycled metal from um, people in Africa. Pretty cool, huh? There's different events that they have throughout the year. So they've got holidays at McKee, Night of Lights. They have a motor car exhibition. Um, we just missed the Garden and Antique show and sale. That was this past weekend. But they also have an annual fairy and pirate festival, which I think is way cute for kiddos. And then this is the map that you get when you um, pay for your admission. I have the map in my hand, too. It does look like a fairy fort or something. Yeah, that's the Royal Palm Grove. There's something on top of that one already. I bet you can go in there though, do you think? Don't climb on it, obviously. But can you go in it? Wow. Holy smokes. Guys, it's so cool in here. Wow. That is a trip. They are just really, really cool looking. And you can see, I mean, it's just woodworked. Oh man. And they all kind of interweave. Hi. Hi. <laughs> 
Oh, this is so, so neat. Very cool. This place is beautiful. Mm -hmm. I found one of the cranes. Oh. Yeah, we're going to go take a better look at him. We lost mom. Oh, she's over there. Look at her. <laughs> There's a lot of fish. Crocodile! So cool. Let's go around this way. There you go. Very cool. Cool. You can go to Walmart. I know when mom suggests it like three times, that means she wants it. <laughs> yeah. It's very pretty. Oh, what's over here, honey? Is it a gorilla? Mm hmm. It's a primate of some sort. Yeah. Man with a gun report at Panera Bread restaurant near Princeton University. That's awful.
Planting seeds for the future. It's McKee Botanical Gardens mission. This is the men of McKee. William Lyman Phillips, Jens Hansen, and Dr. David Fairburn. And then these men are Waldo Sexton and Arthur G. McKee. Good times in the garden. This place that we're in, the Hall of Giants, was a gathering place for social events. It's designed by Waldo Sexton after a Polynesian ceremonial palace. And it was built for the world's to hold the world's largest one-piece mahogany table. And then there's the table here. Wow. I can't imagine having... And this is the world's largest mahogany table. Can you imagine having dinner parties along this table? This is so pretty. Doesn't look like anybody goes up to that second floor anymore. Wow. How beautiful. And it looks really good. Barbecue pulled pork sandwich pickle. with potato salad. You got an ALT, which is avocado, lettuce, and tomato. Looks really fresh. On whole grain. Key lime pie. When in Florida. Yeah. And the turkey sandwich with American cheddar and coleslaw and a pickle. Mm. Mm. Hey guys! So we just got back from shopping and we went to this really cute store called Noteworthy. And it's a stationery store. But one of the things that we found there is this surprise ball. Mm. And on the back it tells you what it is. It says that it's a great gift for adults and kids. You unwind it and there's prizes hidden inside it. So it's kind of like a popper, but a little ball. So I got the mermaid one since, you know, we're at the beach and all. And I wanted to unwrap it with you guys. So I have, took the ribbon off. I'm scared to open it. I like, need to open it to get the prize, but I'm also a little scared because I don't want to ruin it. It's just a really nice crepe paper. I'm wondering if I actually can peel the sticker off and save it. Oh no, I can't. It's going to rip. I'm gonna rip. Oh, there you go. Oh, shoot. Darn it. See, look at me trying to save this mermaid. Oh, there you go. See? I saved her. Okay. So now we can start ripping this thing. Oh. Oh. <coughs> okay. So all the green came off, and now it's white underneath. Well, that's the wrapping paper. Okay. So now here's... Oh! Is that your prize? Someone will whisper something special to you. Listen. Aww. Good fortune. <laughs> okay. Prize number one was a fortune. From like a fortune cookie. <coughs> Ooh. <coughs> There's a little confetti butterfly. Honey, mm. I don't know if it'll focus. Yeah, I'm trying my best, but I don't think it will. Okay, that's fine. From where you're at, it's fine. Okay. Ooh! I remember these! These fortune fish. Do you remember getting these? They yeah. had these in, like, Cracker Jacks and stuff. So you take the fish out and place it in the palm of your hand, and its movements indicate different things. So I'm going to place it in the palm of my hand. And we wait... And it says it's curling its head and tail, so that means I'm in love. Mm. I am in love. Like that, do. Isn't that fun? That is still moving. What are you playing with over there? There you go. Cool. Cool, huh? Mm -hmm. I totally remember these. I, these came in like little Cracker Jacks and whatever. Okay. Put that with my prize over there. Just the act of like unrolling this is like Fun. <laughs> an activity in itself. I got a cat tattoo. Yeah, awesome. don't move, don't move. Let me see if I can get that. <laughs> Oh, 
There you go. Cool. <laughs> And the crepe paper colors are really pretty. They're mermaid colors. The green, the white, the purple. Ooh, ooh, ooh! <gasps> There's definitely something wrapped in here. Cherub's Lost Bell. Wear around your ankle or keep in a special place for good luck. Oh, you can put that on an anklet. That'd be cute. Cool. Cute. It has string in it. Okay, here's another one. It's a cool concept. Yeah, this is fun. It's a Mandy's Confections Butterscotch Hard Candy. Candy. Never candy. Go wrong with candy. That'll be the end of my purple with one more. It's a gem! Wow. Cool. That's interesting. All right, on to the black. Looks like the puzzle that keeps on going. You could totally. Oh! Day of Fun ticket. Keep or give to a friend for one good time when you need it most. No expiration date. Cool. It's a cute little, like a scrapbook thing. Mm hmm You could totally do this on, like, make something like this for somebody. Yeah. It's a good idea. And personalize it for them. Yeah. Oh, it's a little hippo eraser. Hey, hold on, don't move. Don't it's cute. Oh. It's a little hippo eraser. Nice. I can see how for, you know, little ones, this is like. Or for big ones that are 25. Yeah. <laughs> for big kids like me. No, but for, yeah, for little ones. It's fun. It's a flip flop eraser <laughs> or just like a flip flop. Hold on. Oh, I broke it. I broke the flip flop. You have to give it to your teacher. There you go. Can I get a different one? Yeah, for real. It's a little flip flop. That's cute. Mm -hmm. I have quite the stash over here. <laughs> this is my last. This is it. This is the finale. I got a elephant whistle. Is it loud? <whistles> nice and obnoxious. And I got a popper. Oh. Ooh, a popper. So look at all my stuff. Super fun. Tattoos, erasers, candy, a rock, a fortune. That's a fun little thing. That's way cute. Mm hmm. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> In China. Hey guys, it's about seven. Last time we talked to you, what were we doing? We were about to go out to the pool. So we did, we did a little bit of swimming. But we came back and we've kind of been just chilling in the room because it's been some nasty weather. So I'm glad we got in some pool time when we did. We wanted to do the Glow Mini Golf at 8.30, but that doesn't look like that's going to happen right now. We're going to see if we can try to get out and get some food, though. Yeah, honey? We were watching this channel, it's just the Disney Nature Channel, and they showed a clip of Wilderness Explorers, and we got to see Lori. It was neat, huh? Emily. And Emily, yeah. It's weird to have a lot of friends that used to work with. Yeah. Look at this messy place. Look at all that mess on the floor. Uh, <laughs> Eggplant parmesan, carrots, green beans. Eggplant parmesan, carrots and rice. My mama got. There used to be green beans there. <laughs> Meatloaf. 
mashed potatoes and green beans. I went on my run. We got some food. We are now watching Coco. I'm watching Lightning and Thunder over the ocean. Oh, yeah, that too. Um, and we're going to have an early night because it's our last night here. Oh.